Hi, my name is Brian Barton and I'm from Fort Worth, Texas. I'm a uh, bass player and recording enthusiast. And uh, for my presentation today, I'm going to show you how to record electric or bass guitar without an amplifier. Okay, uh, what I'm going to do is uh, we're going to use a, uh, a quarter inch uh, TS cable, also known as a instrument cable or guitar cable, as in, dude, I forgot my guitar cable, can I borrow your guitar cable? Okay, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, plug into my bass first. Okay, I'm going to take uh, the, the one end of the quarter inch TS cable and hook it into my bass. Okay, and then I'm going to hook uh, the under end of this cable up into my uh, audio interface in channel 1. And uh, before I do that, I'm going to make sure that uh, this particular uh, audio interface has uh, dual inputs. It has an input on the front and it has an input on the back that you'll see in a minute. But I'm going to use the front input, so I'm going to want to make sure I'm going to push it in so it's using the instrument input in the front. Uh, if I left it, if I left the uh, the switch out, it will use the mic slash line input that's in the back of the unit. So I'm going to push that in for an instrument cable, and I get the volume all the way down to zero. I'm going to plug it in, and then I'm going to turn it on. Get some level. Okay, now that I have the uh, the bass connected to my audio interface, I'm going to start up my DAW, and I'm going to create a new track, and I'll call it Bass Guitar. And I'm going to arm the track, and I'm going to make sure that my input is selected for the input that I used on the audio device, which is uh, analog in, so that's good. And I'm going to click record. And that's how I uh, recorded bass guitar uh, with, uh, with one method, with just going directly to the audio interface. Now for my next uh, method for recording bass guitar, I'm going to use a direct input box, otherwise known as a DI box or a DI, using a, a quarter inch TS uh, cable and an XLR microphone cable. Okay, okay I'm going to uh, connect the... Uh, TS cable to my base. Connect the other end of the TS cable uh, to the input on my DI. And then I'm going to power on the DI. And when it starts blinking, this particular one's ready to go. Okay, there it is. And now I'm going to hook up the uh, XLR connector to it. Now I'm going to hook the female end of the XLR cable up to the, the DI. Make sure it snaps and locks into place. Okay, with the uh, with the male end of the XLR cable, I'm gonna hook that into input one on my audio device. And on the front of my audio device, I'm gonna click this button to use the, uh, the back input, which is the mic slash line input in the back. And then I'm going to raise up my level to a suitable recording level. Okay, now with my DAW already open, I will go ahead and open up a track. And I'll name it Bass Guitar. And I'll arm it for recording. I'll check to make sure the input is set for uh, input one on my uh, audio device. And it is. So then I'll click record and play. So it looks like it's good. I'd like to thank you for watching. Have a great day.